In this video, I am going to show you how to set up Canon Pixima TS3700 series printer with a Windows 11. So this is a wireless setup. We will connect it and we will use it with the Windows 11. First step is to switch on the printer and then go to your Windows screen. Open the web browser. Type in Canon IJ setup. Look for the Canon website that says Canon official manuals welcome. Select it. On this page, click on the setup. Start here. We have to type in the exact model number of the printer that is TS37 and you will see after that model will be 20222529 like that. So select your model and then click on the go. That is our printer. Click on the start. Go to the second option and click on the connecting to a computer smartphone. Select it. On the first you will see there is an option to do the download. Click on the download. It will take you to the Microsoft store and here we can download the Canon print app. If you don't have this app you can download it and then open it. So we'll do our complete setup using this app. In the app you will see there is a add printer icon so select it click on the add printer this process might take few minutes so we just have to complete the process click yes It will ask you to check if the printer is on. So we have switched it on. So press next. We have few options to use this printer using Wi-Fi, using wired LAN or USB connection. Right now we are going to use the Wi-Fi connection. Click next on it. It will ask you if your printer has a button like this with the two overlapping circles. Yes, we have. Click next. Go to your printer display panel. Press and hold this button for three seconds. One, two, three. Release it. You will see the power light starts to flash. And one light. Wireless line wireless signal and a line will start to flash once the two lines will start to flash that means printer is ready for the setup automatically your printer will be detected by the windows it will display the wireless connection so make sure your laptop is already connected to the Wi-Fi and then click on the connect Sometimes this setup takes longer because we have to download the complete drivers. Also it depends upon the signal strength. So if you have a router nearby, it will do faster. If your router is far away from the printer, it may take longer. And in case you encounter any problem in the setup, make sure you place your printer near the router and then do the setup.
connection is done and we have installed the printer click on the test print so we will check if our print is working or not so yes print is working go to the display panel and click on the next it will ask you to go to the website you can go there for further setup or you can close this window on this screen we can see Canon TS3700 series printer and we can start using it for wireless printing and scanning it displays a lot of information like estimated level of ink and uh, we can also print photos we can scan so let's do a scanning click on the scan icon now before we start the scanning process we have to place a page for the scanning open this lid place a page facing down and close it go to the app section and or just some settings you can select document if it's a photo you can select the photo select the original size that is a letter size select the resolution you can increase or decrease the resolution from here normally 300 dpi is best once you are ready click on the scan icon below scan is transferred and we can see this scan is available if you want to add more pages you can do that you can save it as a pdf jpeg or png you can also save multiple pages as a single file click on the save icon here we can see the options where we can save it you can give a name to your file like test page and then click on the save let's press ok now we can go back to the main screen and we can also close all the other windows that is the wireless setup of the printer using a windows laptop so this way we can do the setup thanks for watching